How do? Welcome to today's tutorial. What I'm going to show you today is how to rewire in both Logic and in Cubase. So we're rewiring Reason to them both. Okay, so I'm going to start off with Logic because I've got it open. Uh, you know, you give this, you've got this option right at the beginning. What I want you to do is do an external MIDI. So we create that, and it brings this up here. So what we want to do then is open Reason. Where are you at, Reason? the boom open reason bugger 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 boom so reasons open it's the rewire one so i'm gonna put in and then an xt loads it in i'll just check the back's hooked up so i press tab and on the back i can see it's hooked up to the audio output okay so far so good the next step what you want to do before you go over to any of this bit is you press command and two and it brings up your mixer. When you click click this plus sign, you're putting another auxiliary channel in. So this is giving us the rewire. So you go to reason, you go reason left and right. Um, it's just saying that we're getting our input from reason for that channel. Do you know what I mean? So when we've clicked on that, we've set that up, we can close that. Click on doused. And reason now should have an NXT. So I click on NXT, it's gone there. If I bring up my little keyboard, it's as simple as that. Um, yeah, so that's how to do it in Logic.